How y'all doing today? I don't know how to act today. It's my birthday. What can I say? What can I say? That's what we doing out here today. Listen, big and mean turning up. About to go out real quick. Listen, it's about to be a, it's about to be a movie. It's a movie already. Y'all see the jacket? Y'all see it? <clears throat> I don't know how to act. It's my day. That was sparkling cider. I don't even drink for real. But this is my shit. I like sparkling cider. Sparkling cider. This is red grape. I'm gonna go turn up. That's all I know. I'm not gonna be drunk, but I'm gonna enjoy myself. I'm gonna try to. Wherever I'm going. And I hope y'all do the same with y'all life. Keep that same, keep that same energy. You know what I mean? Just go through life, try to enjoy it. Try to enjoy your life because tomorrow's not a promise. You know what I mean? You can walk out the house and, you know, I don't want to wish this on anybody, but something could happen to anybody. You just you just never know. So that's why you're supposed to just, you know, live your life. Try to enjoy as many things as possible. You know what I mean? Try to be nice to people. I, you know, helping people, even, even a simple good morning, yo. A simple good morning or a hello, that could literally turn somebody's day around, like, crazy you you never know the impact of what that could do for people you know just a simple good morning bro somebody could have been having the worst morning of their life thinking nobody's nobody can hear them thinking they're invisible you know something could have just happened to them that good morning could just change their whole fucking change their whole mind like it can really just it can help people you know kindness is one of the greatest strengths you can have. People really take kindness as a weakness, but in reality, kindness is one of the biggest strengths you can have. Because when you're kind to people, they remember you. When you're mean to people, they also remember you. But who wants to be remembered for being a dickhead? There's the Philly in me. But who, who wants to be remembered for being a, a, a meathead? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Because maybe, maybe later in life, the person you was nice to could put you in a better position. You know what I mean? You never know. Like, pay it forward with the niceness. Shit like that. That The universe will pay you back tenfold. That's a guarantee. Hey, real stuff, though. Thank y'all for all the support y'all been showing me. I thought I should just post a little something just to <clears throat> give another quick little thanks to you guys. I really appreciate all the support that y'all been giving me. Uh, I'm turning 47 today. So thank y'all for the birthday wishes if you so choose to wish them on me. You know, I'm not asking you to, but if you if you do, they're welcome. Um, I just thought I should give y'all a little, you know, a little background knowledge on me. Like, you know, who, who am I, basically? Who am I? You know, for those that don't know me, which is probably 99, maybe if not 100% of y'all. But if you don't know me, my name is, uh, I'm from Philly, born and raised in Philadelphia. I wonder if y'all can hear the accent, though, that's coming out. Like, do I, do I sound like I'm from Philly? Honestly, you know, cause I can, you know, I don't always talk the same all the time. You know, like I, I cold switch, you know, with, with different people, I cold switch, you know, you know, you can't, you can't, you can't always talk slang and things like things of that nature. You know, you gotta be able to switch it up around different types of people. You know what I mean? It might be a, a you know, a business opportunity that presents itself to you. If you decide to say, yo man, what's up with you bull? Shit like that, come on. That's not professional. That's getting off topic. We're, we're here to talk about y'all and me. Mostly me. Hot. Cause today is my birthday. Yes, I said it again, I'm turning 50. Um, But yeah, once again, I'm gonna say thank y'all. But uh, let me see, work. I said I'm from Philly already. Grew up here. I have a dog and a cat. One name is Thor and the other is Star. Thor's the dog, Star's the cat, of course. I posted them in the other video, one of the other videos about the ghosts and all the other shit. But eventually I wanna do a Q and A with y'all, eventually, like down the line somewhere. I don't know when, but eventually that's gonna come up. So be ready for that. Uh, I don't really know what else to say. I need questions to be asked so I can answer them. Um, let me see, I like, what do I like? You, yo, you you know when you get put on a spot when somebody say, what do you like? You Everything just jumps out of your head. Like, 
I like, let me see. I like games, video games and shit. I like scary movies, I like art. I like boxing, I like fucking, uh, I don't know, I don't know. That, that question always makes me draw a blank, but it'll, it'll come eventually. Y'all gonna see what I'm about. Just give it time, you know? Um, what kind of music do I like? Rap. I'm literally, I listen to rap like 90, 99%, 95% of the time. I still listen to other things too. I like oldies. Like I listen to everything from Sam Cooke, Frank Sinatra, to fucking Lil Durk, Meek Mill, all of the, everything in between that. But I at the end of the day, I like what I like. That's all I can say. Um, I don't know where else to really go with this. I'm just talking right now. But once again, thank y'all for the support that y'all been giving me. Keep it up. Keep the energy up. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep the same energy, and I'm gonna go harder all next year. You hearing it here first. But uh, yeah. Once again, thank y'all. Really appreciate it. Subscribe. Like, share the shit. If not, it's cool too. But I hope y'all enjoy the rest of your day. Or whenever you're watching this. And uh, I'll see y'all later. I'm out of here. Peace.